गुड मॉर्निंग माय डियर स्टूडेंट्स वेलकम टू द केमिस्ट्री प्रैक्टिकल क्लास टुडे आई विल डेमोस्ट्रेट फ्रेम टेस्ट ओके फ्रॉम माय होम एंड यू हैव टू नो अबाउट दिस फ्रेम टेस्ट ओके एक्चुअली हियर वी हैव टू यूज गुंस एंड फ्रेम बट इन माय होम आई विल यूज स्पिरिट लैम ओके देयर आर सम कंपाउंड्स ओके ऑफ सर्टेन मेटल्स that will give a uh, characteristic color to a flame okay and there are, there is some procedure to uh, check the flame of different salts okay and by which uh, by this process we can easily detect the metal cation okay present in the salt so first we have to take one a very thin platinum wire okay and first we have to clean the platinum wire by dipping concentrated acid that i am showing you okay so this is your platinum wire you see see this is platinum wire hope you are able to see one loop is there okay now first you have to take the concentrated acid okay in watch glass so i have taken some concentrated acid and then you have to clean the platinum wire first now platinum wire is almost clean okay it is not giving any color now what is our first test okay our first test is given that calcium so we have to take some calcium salt and we have to make paste with hydrochloric acid definitely it will produce calcium chloride that will be volatile okay now if we uh, heat the platinum wire with this calcium chloride okay uh, means calcium is converted into chloride salt okay then it will show uh, brick red color in the flame when we observe in naked eyes okay but if we uh, wash through double blue cobalt glass it it may so light green but here cobalt blue double blue cobalt glass is not there actually it is absorbing the yellow color of sodium okay or golden yellow color and it will so different colors okay so first uh, we have to take some calcium salt okay Here already we have prepared a solution of calcium chloride. Now here you see the flame. You will get some brick red color. Okay, the color is not persistent. It will come and go. Okay. Now see one brick red color. You will be able to see. Hope you are able to see. One red color is coming. Again, I am showing here. So I am touching this uh, calcium chloride compound with this platinum, okay, and then we are holding it here. Brick red color is coming. Whether you are able to see or not, I don't know. Okay. Here you see. Brick red color is coming. Okay. Now again you saw. Brick red color is coming. Okay. The big red color is coming. It's coming and going. And by this test, you can easily identify the calcium ion. Again, you see the color is coming and going. Okay. So in this way, we can easily detect the calcium. next another salt we will take 
ओके फर्स्ट यू हैव टू क्लीन द प्लेटिनम वायर प्रॉपर्ली अगेन यू हैव टू टेक सम डायलूट एसिड एंड यू हैव टू क्लीन द प्लेटिनम वायर एंड देयर विल बी नो कलर नाउ इट इज नॉट गिविंग एनी कलर नेक्स्ट आई विल टेक सम पोटेशियम सॉल्ट दैट यू हैव टू डिसॉल्व इन एसिड एंड इन केस ऑफ नेकेड आइज ओके व्हेन यू ऑब्जर्व थ्रू योर नेकेड आइज you will see some lilac color or violet color okay here i am showing you here you see that potassium is showing some violet color okay here you see violet color is coming this is called lilac or violet color again i am trying to show here this is called lilac or violet color and by this test you can easily identify the potassium okay if you observe through uh, double book proven gas you will uh, observe some pink color okay so in this way you can easily identify the potassium ion okay next we will go for sodium ions so again we have to take some sodium salt So I have taken sodium carbonate, okay, inside this HCl, and we have to heat in the inside the spirit lamp, okay. Definitely, it will show you some golden color, and if you observe through. Double blue cobalt glass. It will absorb the yellow color, and yellow color will be vanish. Now you see the golden yellow color. See, hope this golden yellow color is coming. So this indicates sodium is present. Okay, and if you observe through double blue cobalt glass, definitely there will be no yellowish color. Okay, here you see. On golden yellow flame is coming. This is because of Na plus R. And if you uh, check it through double book of glass, this yellow color will be absorbed and it will vanish. Okay. Next one more important salt is there. That is the copper salt. So again we have to throw this solution. we have to take the fresh acl okay and then we will take some copper salt and we have to pre make a paste with this acl okay that means hydrochloric acid and it will form cucl as it is in plus 2 state okay it will form cu cl2 now i am touch taking this salt chloride salt of copper so we have converted to hcl then we are touching this flame and here you see the greenish flame you are getting okay again we will do the test and this is indicating that copper is present See here, and greenish flame is coming. Okay, again I am trying to show you. I have to take more amount of salt. Here we have taken little bit of copper salt, dissolved in HCl. and then we are here you see what color is coming blue is green color is coming 
even if you observe the same okay through uh, double to cobalt glass same color you will observe okay again i am showing you so this is called fem test again you see okay again i am taking some copper sometimes uh, if available if uh, platinum is not available you can do the test by using platinum asbestor or nichomer okay okay again i have taken some that copper chloride again if you apply heat as you see you will get that bluish green color okay so in this way you can easily detect the metals okay like sodium potassium calcium copper barium also will give some light green color okay and uh, lead will give some bluish white color okay tin also will give some bifurcations that are not in, these things are not in your syllabus okay so uh, fem test is uh, very good okay sometimes you can uh, identify the cations okay like barium calcium strontium by this fem test okay strontium will give uh, deep red color okay so hope you can understand okay and hope you have enjoyed this fem test and next day we will try to demonstrate more practicals from our school lab thank you